The police department responding after a Facebook video posted by a former officer received more than 15,000 views online. In that video, the officer making claims of corruption within the department. And tonight, the chief of police launching an investigation. 23 ABC's Eliza Navarro spoke to that officer and has more on the allegations being made and how BPD is responding. Eliza. That's right, Tim. Earlier tonight, I spoke to former BPD officer Chris Messick, who posted this video online over the weekend. Now, in the video, Messick says he has been retaliated against for speaking up about wrongdoings in the department. In a statement released this afternoon, the chief of police says they are taking it seriously. I made an allegation where I made a complaint for the violation of the uh, Peace Officer Bill of Rights. Because I did that, I have now been on administrative leave for eight months or seven months. On September 29th, former Bakersfield police officer Chris Messick uploaded a video to Facebook claiming corruption within the Bakersfield Police Department. Since then, that video has been viewed more than 15,000 times. In the video, Messick claims he has proof that two captains violated the Peace Officers' Bill of Rights. A law passed off for due process to officers during any investigation relating to actions they took while on duty. He claims hours after he reported these actions, he was reprimanded for it and placed on leave. He claims the department told him the reason he was being placed on leave was for speeding through a red light while following a car on duty. A retired lieutenant, we're talking the other day, and I'm like, if I would have never filed that grievance, I'd be at work right now. I'd be in a patrol car right now. Messick was hired by the department in August of 2009. He was shot in the leg during an officer-involved shooting while responding to reports of shots fired and a fight at a party in Central Bakersfield in November of 2010. He was later awarded the Division Commander Commendation in December of 2011 for his actions during that shooting. BPD says they cannot comment on why Messick was placed on leave but the department says he was let go at the end of last week. In a statement released by BPD Monday, Chief Lyle Martin has now ordered an investigation into Messick's allegations, saying in part, I stand with the men and women of the Bakersfield Police Department, and all officers are expected and required to immediately report any misconduct to their supervisors or to internal affairs. He says Messick's allegations will be investigated by internal affairs and criminal investigators and will forward the results to the Kern County District Attorney for review. Messick says that this video is his way of standing up for the officers who have been treated the same way as him. This isn't, you know, this isn't something that I just did as a, you know, oh, you guys are doing this to me, I'm going to do it to you. No, I've been wanting to do this for a very long time. Um, this has been in the works. Uh, like I said, all the stuff that I found out about, I reported that to another agency several months ago. In the statement from Bakersfield Police Chief Martin, he encourages anyone who knows of any wrongdoing within the department to come forward. He says the department is committed to maintaining, quote, the highest standards of ethical conduct. And in studio, Eliza Navarro, 23ABC.